So let's talk about clutches. This week, I'm gonna be installing my B16A transmission that I got from JDM of California into my Integra. So right now I've got a B18B1 transmission, which is stupid long and it doesn't have LSD. The B16A has got shorter ratios and LSD, but it does need a new clutch. So I got the Stage 1 HD from Action Clutch and it comes with the pressure plate, the friction, and then the flywheel, the key, and then the throwout bearing, pilot bearing, and also the bolts that hold this whole assembly together. The most important thing here is to not over clutch your car. So when I was younger, I was dumb. I had a stock Honda Civic. It made 130 horsepower and I wanted to put a stage three because it sounded dope to my friends, right? Like, hey bro, I got a stage three in here. And they're like, oh, well, how much horsepower is your car making? I'm like, yeah, like 130 with intake header and exhaust. They're like, you're an idiot. I'm like, what? For 130 horse, stage one is perfect, okay? You still get good modulation. When you step on the pedal, it's it's nice and you can you can modulate, you can let go and you can play with it. But with a stage three, stage four, five, six, whatever it is, like the drag spec, once you let go, it's almost like there. There's really no modulation. And if you can even step on it, because it's really heavy. So when I spec this clutch out, I told my guys at Action Clutch, hey, my car is gonna be making like 170 max. And then I told them the torque, okay? Because it's not really the horsepower, it's about the torque. So I told them, eh, 170, maybe 150 foot pounds of torque. And they said, okay, cool, stage one HD, lightweight flywheel, and you should be Gucci for your track and Canyon use, okay? So don't overclutch your car, just make sure what your torque needs are, and then you should be good.